What's up guys? Welcome back to Atlas. I am doing some rhino taming. Uh, about to go and tame a rhino. But I'm still going to use the billboards to get this done. Uh, I think what I'm going to do though is go to a region where I've got rhinos and giraffes nearer to where my main base is and to where I mainly play the game up north. And um, obviously there's no rhinos up north, but you know I mean closer to my area that I play in and uh, set up a couple of taming pens that I'll go and go and check now and then and go and tame uh, more rhinos, giraffes, etc. so I can start breeding them eventually. But for now I'm just going to try and do this with um, my billboards. Um, it's how I've done it in the past and it does work and it's just low effort compared to building a taming pen and leaving it on you know, someone else's island and uh, all wasting materials in building a pen and then deleting it when I'm just, you know, on my way through kind of thing. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Hopefully this is going to work. So I'll try and just box them in without damaging them first and see if I can get that done. And um, yeah, and if I can't, I'll uh, jump on the bear, we'll bowler him, get him bowlered, and then we'll board him in afterwards. Alright, there we go. It's not pretty, but it should do. These little gaps I leave us so you can get the bear through to actually hit the rhino. Um, the gaps like this you will sometimes struggle to um, hit the rhino with. And um, the same with these. I've just left them so I can uh, hopefully get a couple of hits in on them. hope that gap's not too big. I don't think it is. And um, yeah, here goes nothing. Oh, before I do this actually... Uh, this is always handy. I'm just going to get a bed made and put down. So we'll just get this put down somewhere here and I'll pick this up when I'm done. And because uh, I'm imagining I'm going to die a few times doing this. And uh, it just is what it is. If you know an easy way of doing this on your own, then you know, feel free to let me know down in the comments and I'll definitely try out any methods that you guys suggest to me. But um, yeah, this, like I said, this is how I've always done this um, when I can't be bothered to build a trap. Um, and yeah, normally what I've been doing more recently, this time where I've been playing Atlas since I've come back, is um, obviously doing it with a friend. But like I've said in my previous videos recently, they're all playing other stuff right now. So I'm on my Todd's, I'm all on my own, and um, yeah, this is the only way I can really do it. So um, yeah, hopefully this will work. Um, got my bed down we've got some turnips by the way turnips are what the um, rhinos eat that's their preferred food their preferred kibble and then we'll obviously tame them up quicker I've also got um, taming proficiency in my skill tree um, but I don't have any um, oh, I haven't got the last one unlocked uh, normally I do but I didn't do it this time uh, but normally I would do but I haven't got any um, music buffs for taming either on me on my ship uh, a little bit annoyed but I wasn't planning on taming I was just sailing back the wind was wrong direction hence why I thought I'd do something and I do need a new rhino a new giraffe and I need a new elephant as well so um, yeah anyway let's let's try and get this done see what happens one for luck right that's her down let's get him out of the way and uh, let the massacre commence. Oh, okay. First one's in. We're doing good. Oh, I didn't see a timer. It's about 20 seconds. Also, obviously, this is only a low rhino. Again, because I'm on my own and I know it's going to be a pain in the ass to get them tamed, I'm not really bothered about the level right now. Um, obviously, when I start breeding and stuff, I would like a um, higher level one. But um, at the moment, I just want one to be able to quickly farm stone for some building projects um, away from my main base. So, um, yeah, I need another set of farming dinos, hence why I'm doing this. But, yeah, it isn't a very high level, um, but it is what it is. And it just makes things easier. If it's a lower level and you're on your own, obviously it's easier to tame. I've got the um, feeding bug there. I've got a bit luckier. It seems to have uh, got a little bit bugged on the billboard and it's preventing the rhino from hitting me. Normally this thing will be launching into orbit every time you try and feed it. 
Um, and I have tried standing at different angles to um, to feed it, um, standing behind it, standing under its belly, all that kind of stuff. And I, I still kept running into problems while trying to feed it. Um, as in, it still kept hitting me. Not this one, but um, one I tried to tame recently. And uh, the annoying thing about the one that I was trying to tame before, well, when I decided to try and get another one, was actually level 29. Um, and yeah, it was really hard on my own. I couldn't get anyone to come and help me, so. I had to give up on that, but um, I died about 20 odd times, if not more. So let's just try it from the back, see if I can get it to um, eat without hitting me. Okay, she seems quite happy right there. I'll move away just not to bug her out. Um, I will say the last one I was trying to tame wasn't on nice flat ground like this. So I don't. I, I do think sometimes if the ground's not flat and you're on like uneven surface, it does cause um, issues with the animals and they seem to bug out a little bit more. Um, but I definitely wasn't being able to um, get up and close like I can with this one. Okay, guys, so this seems to be working. I'm just sort of like walking up to its shoulder blades, uh, that being the front part of the rhino, obviously behind its head, the big bulky part. And um, she seems to just be fine with me doing this. Uh, five seconds. I'll just stand here for the last few seconds, and she seems perfectly fine. So, um, yeah, maybe it does work. Maybe I was just getting unlucky on the last um, rhino I tried to tame. Which I should have just recorded just for the laughs, because um, <laughs> it was ridiculous how many times I died. But it was kind of a spur of the moment. And with this one I just thought, we'll tame it, we'll see what happens, I'll record it, and um, it'll either send me into orbit or we'll get it tamed. Or eventually I would have got it tamed anyway, I wasn't going to give up with this one, I really do need another Rhino, so. Alright, let's get this on it. Got it. So this time, this might be where I'm going to have an issue, because um, I'll just try and quickly feed her while she's here. She caught me then. Um, but if I go around this side for the next few, um, her shoulders are actually under the billboard. So maybe that is going to cause an issue. We'll see. We'll try it out. No, she seems still seems... Oh, I'm getting the feed bug here. I can't press E to feed. Oh, uh, but her head swinging actually allowed me to get that. But until I got right up to her head, she seemed fine. So, uh, yeah, I must have been getting really unlucky on the last one I'd done. Uh, like I mentioned in my auction house and trading video, if you join that Discord, again, the link will be in all the descriptions of every single Atlas video from now on, um, you can get access to um, Animal Traders. Oh, there you go. I've been all of it. On the um, EU server, at least. And... Um, I was speaking to someone that plays on the NA PVE server and there's a very similar um, kind of community on there. I don't know if it's as active as what we've got in the EU right now, but um, yeah, if you're playing NA there is similar things on there. But anyway, yeah, point being, if you're on the EU you can go to that Discord in the description and go to other traders and you'll be able to go across to the um, other companies that are animal traders and stuff like that. Um, let's just get this one down. I bet you God I didn't get that last turnip on. I'm probably going to die on this one. Try and get another feed on her though. That seemed to work. Ah, she got me. But we put our beds down, so not too much of an issue. Let's try and get a quick feed on it. No. No. Oh, it's bugged out. I can't get the... It's not letting me feed. Um, yeah, they've put a new patch out and done some bug fixes and stuff. I really wish they would do something with the taming. Um, I didn't mention it in my patch video, but I do wish they would do something to the taming. Uh to make it a bit more friendly. 
I only got two feeds on that, I think, didn't I? In that that set, that um that round round of taming. God damn English hard. Got her. Let's try again. See if I can get it to work. So hopefully it won't bug out this time. Yay! Okay, we've probably lost some efficiency on her now, though. Oh, she's still going to get her four levels. <laughs> Amazing four levels that are going to make her a super rhino. Um, but yeah, like I said, I, I'm not too bothered. I'll just level her up. As long as she's got decent weight and a little bit of stamina, that's fine for me. Um, like I mentioned earlier, guys, if you've got any other methods I could be using to do this or any little tricks, you know, to make things easier as a solo player... Um, because like I said, if you're playing with just a friend, you can do this very easy. In fact, um, you don't always even need to, to build any kind of pen, in my opinion. If you've got a friend, you can just one of you can damage and bail, and the other one can just feed. And that way, if you're feeding, you don't get aggroed anyway, because you haven't done nothing to the rhino. Um, but yeah, if you've got anything for, for making things easier as a solo tamer, then uh, yeah, let me know. Ah, oh, damn it! I stayed too long. Thought I was going to get away with that. That was my bad. No! I was hoping to get another feed on before she stood up. Come on, baby, please. Please. Eat my turnip. Yes. Oh, boy, scorpion. Quick, 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 quick. Better to lose a, a feeding slot than uh, get beaten up by the scorpion. I'm going to leave these bodies here so we can uh, see how bad this went at the end. So far, um, <laughs> I feel like it's not too bad. I have died a few times, but, you know, we're getting the job done just about. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. I'm just trying to give you turnips. Actually, the dead bodies are kind of handy at night to uh, <laughs> act as a light source. Alright. Okay, successful this time. That was good. That was good. Get up. Oh no, it resisted. Got her. Oh no, last one, damn it. Ah. Oh, I might be able to get, get it in still. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> oh no, what's happened? What the hell's going on? Oh man, she hit me so far. Oh no, is that a shark? Oh my god, she hit me into a shark's mouth. Oh man, please tell me I didn't manage to leave myself. I don't think I did. She's right in the, um, above my body. If I get her health down there, she might uh, move away. Oh, no, 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 no. Yep, 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 yep. Can I get her through this? Yeah. Oh god, she's lost so much that time and that that chaos. Hi Bert. Look at it. I love the bears in this game, look amazing. Hello buddy. Oh god damn, I keep miscounting. It's infuriating. God damn it. Yes, managed to get another one on. Come on, just a couple more nice successful rounds and we'll have a... One more here. Come on. Oh, 
harder. Oh, it's bugged a little bit. Oh, god damn. Oh, she got me from there. Ah, oh, this is a nightmare. How? Oh, I don't even know if I managed to feed her. Okay, it's not going good now. It wasn't too bad at the start. Just can't get her to eat. She just won't eat, stupid bug. I wish they would at least fix that. If they're not going to do anything to tame it, just fix that annoying bug where they won't eat. Just says press E and nothing happens. I'm just going to try and run in and feed her. No, it didn't even appear that time. It's not appearing now. Oh, no. Yes. Oh, God. As if she fell on my bear. I actually need her to attack now. Oh, no. She... Oh, okay. Uh, but if you sit on her head, she seems to like eating my turnips more. Okay, maybe it's not such a bad thing. Yeah, you sit there, buddy. Oh, God damn. Okay, she doesn't like you sat on her head. Did that feed? Yes, it did. Oh, come on! Seems better when she's over this side. Maybe there's maybe them rocks on the other side uh, bug it out. Now this on this side's gonna be no different. Ah, oh, I know this side they she smacked me into. Ah, oh, she's fell on my bear again. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is a disaster. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Please don't eat me, shark. Not this time. Oh, I did manage to feed it. Oh, no! Oh, no. I've got everything on my body and it's just been smacked out to sea. Oh, my God. Maybe. Well, <laughs> well, it stopped my body flying away, that's for sure. Okay, it worked, kind of. <laughs> I don't mean go fed her either. Oh, man. Eat the damn turnips. Why can't I feed her? Oh, there we go. Will she let me sit here? Was I doing it wrong? Should I be sat under a stomach? Is it? Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> didn't, I wasn't watching the timer. I don't think she could actually hit me there, even if she was trying to hit me. It's working. It's working! It just wanted a cuddle while we fed it turnips. That's all she wanted. Oh boy! Oh, can I get this in before the time when they're exactly the same? That's almost exactly the same, isn't it? I think. Spammy, spammy. I don't know if she got it or not. Where's my bear? 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 Where? Hello? What's he doing down there? Bear? God damn it. I'm surprised you weren't drowning. I didn't even realise you was in the water. Come on. Can this be the last one? Oh man, I just almost jumped on a red. Ooh. Yeah, we did it. Woo. I said it in my uh, bear taming video with a post. If you do do this or any kind of temporary trap or whatever, make sure you pick everything up. It will just, uh, you know, just save lag issues for people or anything like that. And um, just, you know, declutter as you go. 
Right, let's have a look. Mm, trash, okay. Well, I knew it wasn't going to be brilliant, but it's something. Um, I will have to pump some stamina into her. And uh, I don't have a saddle on me because I wasn't planning on doing any taming. But we got the rhino, that's the main thing. And uh, yeah, that's a lot of dead bodies. So um, yeah, that's how I solo tame. Again, if you know any like um, easier things I could have done during that to um, stop dying for one thing, um, or any other kind of methods that work really well uh, for solo play, um, let me know down below. Like I said, if you've got a friend you can jump on with, or obviously if you're in a company and you can grab someone's go and tame with, do it that way. Uh, like I mentioned, if you do it like that, you can have someone on a bear or whatever hitting the rhino and bowler in it, and then you can just feed it. Like So as long as one of you doesn't do any damage and you just feed, um, it shouldn't hit you. Um, and you don't really need a trap then if you did do it like that. Although obviously, if you can make a trap and um, you know you've got the room to do it somewhere, uh, especially if you like own an island or you have a big base on an island, obviously use a trap. Um, if you do use a trap on PVE, leave the gates open if you're going to leave it there. Leave them unlocked so other people can use it. Um, it's really helpful uh, to do that for for the community for one thing, and obviously if you've it j if you leave it there, it's actually useful for people instead of just being clutter. Um, so yeah, like yeah, like I said, you can use a trap in that if you want to, but you don't necessarily need to if you've got a um, friend to do it with. In my opinion, you can do it without them. Um, or low effort trap the billboards like I like to use and if I'm with a friend and we're doing this we still use billboards normally well nine times out of ten we will do and um, yeah it just stops any issues if the animal does decide to run off for some reason um, the rhino does occasionally once it's on low health try and like walk away it will come back to you but it will try and run away a little bit um, so obviously having it in a trap or on billboards does make that a lot easier of course Right guys, before I go, I thought I'd show you the rhino in action. If you don't know what a rhino does in Atlas, it actually farms stone and flint. Um, it's a really fun animal to use as well because it's got a charge ability and you can charge along a beach and slap stuff really hard. And um, yeah, they're, they're just a good animal. And this thing will farm up loads and loads of stone, like a ridiculous amount. And um, it's more than enough to just build stuff in general. So... Um, yeah, they're a really good animal to have around. But yeah, let's uh, quickly show you what it does before we go. So you just charge along. You just left click, whacking stones. Um, they do get stuck on things and they slow down and stop like this. Um, but they soon pick up again. And you just run along. Just keep whacking stuff. We're almost at stamina. And... There you go, that's what we just got in one stamina um, bar. So we've got almost 4k stone, uh, just over a k flint, and then some other bits and pieces from running through the undergrowth. That's just one stamina bar on one really low level, really awful rhino base. It's got really low stats. So um, you can imagine if you've got a few points in weight and stamina, what you can collect on them. And they do it really fast as well, so you can farm like ridiculous amounts of stone really really quickly with even a low level rhino so yeah that's what they do guys and that's how you solo tame one or at least how i solo tame one but yeah hope you enjoyed the video guys hopefully it's helpful to someone or at the very least i hope it was a little bit amusing anyway anyway guys i'll see you in the next one